The Word of God says in Hebrews 4.12 that the Word of God is powerful, sharper than any two-edged sword, and it divides the spirit from the carnal. You know, this is what God is doing in the earth today. You know, we're here in Mexico City uh, once again on its Independence Day. Uh, you know, we uh, uh, are helping them to, to celebrate freedom. Freedom. And, but we also have come here to proclaim liberty and freedom in the Spirit. You know, God says that His Word is so powerful. It is like this, this gun, this gun right here, and these bullets right here are powerful to, to shoot down the enemy. The Word of God is a mighty weapon uh, to destroy the works of of the devil. You know, Jesus said in 1 John that he came to destroy the works of the enemy. And so we are here uh, preaching and teaching the Word of God about freedom, about libre, liberty uh, for the people of God. In Hebrews chapter 12, it says that he's going to shake, God is going to shake this earth, and everything that can be shaken will be shaken, and only those things that are founded in the Word of God, that have the foundation of Jesus Christ, will stand in, this, in the days to come. You know, I think about the man who built his house upon a rock, and the rains came, and the floods came, and the shaking came, but his house, his casa, stood firm because it was built on Jesus Christ, the cornerstone. Hallelujah. You know, then I think about the foolish man that built his house upon the sand, and the rains came, and the floods came, and it shook the foundation, and the foundation cracked, and his, his house was lost. His casa was lost because it was not built on a firm foundation. You know, I think about the revolution, the spirit revolution, and that's that's how I'm I'm dressed today. I'm dressed as a revolutionary because in the spirit that's who I am. I believe that change is needed in the body of Christ. I believe that God wants to make some some dramatic changes in leadership. In the body of Christ. And the, the revolutionaries. Will bring that change. Uh, they will bring that worship. And praise. And intimacy. Uh, unto God. That his glory. May be seen in the earth today. I thank you for viewing this video. And will you please pray for. Pray with us. For the whole world. That they will see. The spirit revolution. Come alive in their churches and in their nations. This is a global message today that I am crying out to the people of God. Join the revolution of God today and change your world. God bless you.